Hello, Cancer, my darlings, and welcome back to my channel, Lumen Moon Tarot. So, Cancer, I am here checking into your energy, right? Your nightly reading. Woohoo! This reading is for the collective, so um, it may not be for all of you, and that's okay. Just take what resonates, Cancer. Leave the rest behind, right? And thank you so much, everyone. Thank you to all of my subscribers. Thank you to everybody new here. You guys know I love you all, right? I love you, Cancer. Holy cow. You're my you're my friends, my family, my peeps out here. All right. So spirit, messages for Cancer, please. Cancer, whatever comes out, comes out. Okay. It's that kind of reading. All right. Ooh, Cancer. I don't know, this person is having a really hard time holding themselves back, okay? Um, they're seeing you in this, oh, you're just so powerful. You're powerful, you're confident, you're strong. That kind of energy is a huge turn on for this person, you guys. I, I keep getting this in your readings, like... Um, they're extremely attracted to you, whoever this is. I feel like it's somebody from your past. Um, oh, Cancer, somebody's got the hots for you big time. <laughs> oh, they got it bad for you, Cancer. Um, and I feel like the longer it goes with no communication, um, the, the more they want you, okay? The more they want you. They see you as everything, all right? The world card. Um, and you're entering into a new, a new phase in your life where you've got all of this abundance and opportunities around you. Look at this confidence, right? Look at this confidence you're exuding. You guys, they're showing me a memory that I have, okay? I just want to share it with you. I used to live and work in Pittsburgh, okay? And um, I was in one Oliver Plaza, and there's this coffee shop in the bottom of, of my building where I worked at. And I was in there getting coffee one day and I look over and there's this plaza, you know, where everybody's like walking around. It's morning. People are going to work. And there's this woman that was walking across the platform. And I swear to you, everyone in the restaurant turned and was watching her. She was, um, she was humble. She wasn't dressed up or anything like that. You know, she was just wearing casual clothes. But the way she carried herself... Oh my gosh, I'll never forget her. It was, um, she, she like made all the energy around her feel electric, okay? And it was because of her confidence, the way she held her head up high, um, the way she just, it was her energy and everybody could feel it. Like we were all kind of like wowed by this, by this woman, you know? And I feel like that's, it's just given me that energy, Cancer. This person's like wowed by you. They're so turned on. <laughs> oh my gosh. Ugh. And they can you know, they've, they're trying to keep their back turned. I feel like they're watching you, Cancer, maybe even talking to you under a fake profile because they're hiding their face here, okay? So if you have a new friend or something on the internet, um, on social media, it could even be this person, you know, hiding behind a fake name, okay? So be careful. Just make sure you know who you're talking to, especially out here on the internet, okay? But yeah, this is like, oh my gosh, it's tearing this person apart, man. The fact that there's so much distance between you. Um, it's only like, it's that saying distance makes the heart grow fonder. That's kind of what this is. And I feel like this person has seen you transform. You're stronger and more confident now than ever before. Okay. You don't seem to even realize that, um, this is a, this is a major turn on for people. Okay. You, you're, um, you're focusing on other things. You're staying in your own lane. You're not rubbernecking. You're not looking you're not like in anybody else's business or anything like that. You're just doing you. And I feel like you're turning heads, Cancer. Like everywhere you go, people feel like this. They feel that light, that spark, that passion. Ooh, Cancer. Holy cow. You, you know, Cancers are very attractive, though. I will say. Cancers are um, one of the most beautiful zodiac signs. Okay. 
Yeah, look. And I feel like it's because you've got um you got spirit with you, okay? Uh yeah, you're being spiritually led. I feel like through this journey the divine has just lifted you up and put you on this pedestal and you're really truly feeling it now, Cancer. You know how special you are. You know you're different for a reason. Um, you know, as long as you follow the divine and let them lead you, you know they're taking you to great things. They have literally put you on this pedestal for all to see. Okay? And it's driving this person over here crazy. They want you more and more every day. I'm telling you, they're like, va, va, boom, cancer. Look at, look what you're doing to people. <laughs> You're making people like you're turning heads. People are um, there. It's almost like they're acting like fools. You walk into a room and walk past them, Cancer, and they're all like drooling. OK. <laughs> I'm not kidding. It is funny, but I'm really not joking. This is what I'm seeing. All right. You may even have somebody like following you around like a little puppy dog. I don't know. It, it almost it almost feels like you've got maybe a secret admirer also i feel like this is someone from your past but this could be somebody new they they could follow you around like a little puppy or they could um oh my gosh i don't know is somebody flirting with you a lot cancer something like that but yeah see here's there's this person from your past man they want to get together with you honestly cancer i feel like anyone you cross paths with now wants to get on your path with you okay um it's almost like you're a tractor beam here <laughs> you know yeah you're pulling the attention in from everywhere you go every, it's all around you um you may notice cancer when you're out and about people just they're interested in you you know they're interested in what you have in your shopping cart the other day you guys I was out shopping and somebody wanted to know what was in my cart. And this was a stranger. You know, um, you might notice that you walk into a restaurant and everybody's looking at you. And Cancer, you're probably like looking at yourself like, do I, you know, are they looking at me funny? Or, you know, it might make you feel self-conscious, but they're not looking at you to criticize. They're looking at your beauty. Okay, I'm not kidding. When you walk into a room, people take notice. When you walk into a room, it changes the energy of the room, of the whole room. And everybody kind of stops, right? And turns around and watches you. <laughs> or they want to be where they are, where you are, Cancer, right? They want to be where you are. Um, maybe you're having a really hard time lately finding time alone or a space alone. Um, I feel like it's everybody, people you know and people that, um, that you don't know. It's everywhere you go. <laughs> yeah, I, I'm just getting the sense, Cancer, that you make people feel really good. Okay? You know, you, this is like, um... The high priestess is being silent still, kind of, she lives life sort of in seclusion a lot, okay? And then all of a sudden, wherever you are, you can be alone somewhere, and all of a sudden, everybody wants to be around you. You make people feel good. You raise vibrations just from the energy you're giving off. Um, holy cow, Cancer. <laughs> you really are like a tractor beam right now. Everybody just wants to be around you, right? <laughs> yeah and I feel like there's a masculine energy who's having this a masculine who's having this tower moment because they realize it cancer and they're watching you too oh my gosh they can't take it no one can seem to here's the thing wherever you go you're pulling people towards you okay because of that beautiful energy and they can't seem to stay away from you like um yeah, they just, they can't, um, they can't resist that pull. They may not even be aware that they're doing it, okay? You are probably aware of it because you can, like, you can never be alone. You could, you could be shopping, Cancer, 
in a, in a in a an aisle that's absolutely empty. I've brought this example up before because it happens to me all the time. Uh, and um, you know, I feel like we're we're kind of quiet people, you know, um, and we like our comfort and we like that personal bubble, right, that we have. But then all of a sudden you'll be in an aisle with nobody in it. And then all of a sudden people will come at you from both ends of the aisle and they'll just want to be in your aisle or you'll be trying to move through. A, let, let's just say shopping, right? It's a good example. You'll be trying to move your cart through the aisle and somebody will just come in and stand there and block you like they don't want you to to leave. They don't want you to leave their energy. They want to keep you around. Um, around them as close as they can and, and this is even strangers are doing this okay <laughs> and you may be like what is going on it's your energy darling you're attracting it you're attracting it cancer okay <laughs> um yeah and it's just that confidence that you've got this healthy glow Okay, your skin looks great. I don't know what you've been doing, but your skin looks awesome. You're very soft. You're very nurturing. You're very knowledgeable. Um, the way you move through a room is like tantalizing is what I'm hearing, tantalizing. So you, you out here tantalizing other people and you don't even know it. Yeah, look, I, then people are like burdened by this, like, I must follow cancer. I must be around Cancer's energy, I'm telling you. Yeah, and whoever this is from your past, see, they've got it bad for you too, right? Um, and they're very burdened as well, um, watching you out here getting all of this attention. Like they can see it, they can feel it, they know it. <laughs> oh honey yeah you know here's the thing you it's it's hard not to get that attention when you're as fabulous as you are let's just look at it that way you know you you may want um seclusion but cancer i feel like like i said you walk into a room you change the energy and you turn all the heads in the room okay you do notice it Look around, you know, when you're when you're entering into some place, I'm telling you, people take notice of you. All right. The next time you're out shopping, let just let me know. Does that happen to you? Right. Put it in the comment section, guys. Does that happen to you when you're out shopping and you're in an aisle alone and everybody all of a sudden wants to come and hoard that aisle wherever you're in? And, you, you know, you um, yeah, you can't seem to get through the store, that kind of thing. Let me know if that's happening. OK um yeah just the other day too i was walking through a parking lot i parked my car and people are like watching me and looking at me and i'm like jesus it's safe to even park my car in this spot you know what i'm saying so you may be experiencing that cancer okay yeah ten of pentacles um somebody's very burdened too because you could be very uh financially stable right now they see you as stability, okay, on this pedestal, walking in confidence and strength. They see you as the picture of stability. And they're burdened because of what they let go of, okay? They're, they're um, worried every day. They're stressed out. These are burdens, right? Stressing out, wondering who you're talking to, wondering who you're giving your attention to, um, uh, knowing that... Um, knowing that you're about to get someone new at any given moment okay this is a lot of anxiety right sleepless nights i feel um they can't seem to stop thinking about this right because you're you're everything you're everything anyone would want in a life partner okay and i feel like this person knows you were the best they ever had you know, um, yeah, you're going to start getting communication from a lot of people, especially people that you don't know. Um, and, you know, somebody here could have believed some lies about you as well, Cancer, but I'm just kind of, that's a side note. I feel like this is communication 
coming in from new people, new soulmate connections. That's the feeling I've got off of that moon card. You know, this is stuff you can't see coming. People that you didn't know before are about to start talking to you. Yeah, you're, <laughs> thank you, spirit. That was my confirmation. You're about to have some new options when it comes to love. Okay, Cancer, a lot of people. There's seven cups here. <laughs> Um, yeah, when it comes to love, friendships, people just want to be around you. I mean, if you think of these cups as people, they just want to be all around you, Cancer. So you start off being alone, kind of in the isolation, and then all of a sudden, everybody wants to be around you. Okay, if this is like in a in an aisle at a store, they're blocking you on one end and blocking you in on another end, and they're just hoarding around you. This is the energy now that you bring into any room you walk into. Okay, so I know that people are going to start asking you out. People are going to be wanting to date you, wanting to talk to you, wanting to meet you. Um, you could be dating, um, online dating here. Be careful for that, Cancer. In the energy that you're in and, and as beautiful and successful as you are, um, I just want you guys to make sure you know who it is that you're talking to, okay? Not everyone is going to be somebody that you can trust. So use your use your intuition and discernment with everyone, but... People cannot resist your energy, Cancer. I don't know what to say. They can't resist you. So, um, and the more confident you get in yourself, the more people are going to want to be around you, okay? I feel like, you know, Cancer, you're kind of a homebody. Like I said, it may make you feel uncomfortable getting all of this attention, um, because I feel like you really just like to be at home. You enjoy your home, your family. You know, um, you've grown very accustomed and, um, and very comfortable with being in isolation and being in your home. That is your safe zone, okay? But spirit wants you to get out and about. And when you get out and about, it's like it's almost overwhelming. It's like too many people just kind of like flock to you. Right? Right? It's true. Um, you'll notice this. If you haven't noticed it yet, you will after you listen to this reading. Uh, yeah, Cancer. Okay. Yeah, Queen of Pentacles. I feel like you really just... You like taking care of your business. You like um, being on stable, solid ground. You like being in the comfort of your own home, right? Some of you could have recently purchased a new home. But, I mean, some of you, most of you don't, well, I don't know about most of you, some, whoever you are that this is resonating with, you really don't talk to many people, you know? You may not have a lot of friends, and that's okay. You're a person who likes to be, you like your alone time. You, let, you don't mind being alone. I'm the same way. I'm the exact same way. I like my space. I like my, my little area. I love my home. I, I'd rather be here than pretty much anywhere. You know, I feel like that's how you feel. You're independent. You're stable. You're grounded. You're taking care of your business. You're minding your own business. <laughs> And man, you go anywhere, Cancer, and nobody, nobody can leave you alone. I love it. Oh, Cancer, I love that. You know, and you're quiet. You, 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 you stand out of a crowd, but you don't really mean to. Like, you're not trying to. Yeah, I honestly, what's with this death card? clarify this death card death and transformation that's what this is i just get the feeling like you maybe you've had your fill of going out and celebrating and partying and you're just like you're you're not feeling it and feeling it anymore some of you don't even want love some of you don't want a relationship right now you're fine right where you are you're totally cool with that right you're totally cool with that, but I feel like spirit is sending you somebody new, okay? They're, 
Spirit's telling you, look, it's time for you to get love, Cancer. Maybe some of you are afraid to date or just you're not comfortable with it right now. You're in a comfort zone in your home. And I feel like Spirit's trying to tell you, well, we're sending you new love in, so get prepared, okay? Because I feel like um, change is coming here. Get prepared, Cancer. Whether you're ready for it or not, somebody, the divine is sending you somebody in, okay, who's going to love you the right way. And your person from your past, I feel like they're going to miss this opportunity. Spirit's sending you a brand new emperor. Look at this. Oh, Cancer, here's your new beginning. Okay, here's, here's somebody who is going to vibe at your level, okay? This is an emperor that Spirit is sending to you. These are blessings from the hand of God. So, yeah, ready or not, Cancer, you, you can't hide yourself away, um, you know, for much longer. Spirit wants you to be loved. They want you to experience the right kind of love. Okay, because you're you are ready for that now. And this person from your past, they're when they find out you've got a new emperor, they're gonna be heartbroken. They're gonna regret the day they ever turn their back on you because this person wants you so bad, as do as do a lot of people. Okay. <laughs> you could be like, I don't know what's going on. Why are why is everybody staring at me? Why do people want to be around me all the time? You know, they're in my personal bubble, right? What, here's your bubble. Here's your personal bubble, Cancer, right here. Okay? <laughs> and they get, they want to get right up in there, Cancer. I'm telling you, people cannot get enough of your energy because you make people happy. You make other people happy. You make them feel good. You've got these, these high vibes, right? Um, positive vibrations just like exuding off of you that confidence that strength right oh my gosh it's everybody everybody wants to feel that off of you but spirit saying you know there's going to be one that deserves your love they're going to be worthy of your love and here they come right so spirits like i feel like they're trying to say the days of um locking yourself inside your home right that's what this is Locking yourself inside your home, wanting to keep to yourself, those days have to change, okay? Something about that is going to transform. That's when spirit, justice, sends in this new emperor to love you right, okay? So get ready, Cancer. <laughs> And you guys, um, I mean, good luck. Uh, whenever you go out, I feel like people are just going to be bombarding you, okay? Coming at you from all directions, Cancer. You're going to notice it. Please drop a comment, you guys. Um, I would love to hear that. Uh, because, and it's your energy, just know that. It's your energy, your confidence, okay? Just know that. And also, I just thank you, Divine. You're not out here trying to seek anybody's approval, and people find that as a major turn-on, okay? You're, you're very confident, and they love that about everybody. You're turning heads. Anyway, Cancer, that's what I've got for tonight's reading. I love you guys. Um, I hope this helps. I hope it resonates. Like and subscribe to the channel. Join this awesome soul tribe. And until next time, Cancer, take care of you and peace out.